We do it for the gram, but what does the gram do for brands? Coming up next on Culture Vulture Live. Gabriella here, and this week we're talking about a trend that Mindshare has been tracking called Me Dia. Today, for millennials and Generation Z, pins, posts, and retweets are acting as the ultimate form of identification on social media. In fact, 90% of Gen Z admits to purchasing a gift based on social media influence. This is forcing brands to be more aware of their aesthetic than ever before. For example, Taylor Swift, queen of the perfectly curated Instagram feed, posted a photo of herself on a swan-shaped pool raft in 2015. Two years later, Amazon has reported a 200% year-over-year increase in orders of pool rafts in various shapes, like pizza, unicorns, and even palm trees. Gone are the days of picture-perfect pristine pools. Social feeds are now full of photos of silly-shaped rafts floating in the water. And in a moment of ultimate Instagram inception, one of the stickers you can add to images on the popular platform is, you guessed it, a unicorn raft. Media is also evident in new trends we're seeing around the restaurant scene. Today's culinary ventures are being driven by visual concepts more than ever before, all thanks to social media. Restaurants have always wanted their spaces to be attractive, but in recent years, Accent features like bold wallpaper and unique floor tiles have surged in popularity. And many places are adjusting their lighting to best highlight the plating work of chefs. Social media can even dictate which sorts of bars and restaurants are being built. For example, the number of tiki bars in New York City has doubled in the past year. Not that we're complaining! London restaurant Dirty Bones has even started handing out photo shoot kits so diners can get the perfect food porn shot. We don't think this media trend is going away anytime soon, so brands must continue to keep visual platforms top of mind. Marketers can create campaigns that encourage their audiences to express themselves online, and they can do it while making sure customers consider their favorite brands a part of their identity. Thank you for watching Culture Vulture Live. For more information on the latest in adaptive marketing, visit mindshareintheloop.com.